trying to talk to the kids to see if they have a raft so I can have a little bit of fun out here. You know, here in the middle of the road where I'm standing, it's really not that deep, but you get down past the dumpster and the water came up over the top of my boots. And we've been out here all afternoon. It has not receded much at all. And the residents over here tell me this is not the first time this road has looked like a river. On Detroit's west side, Lawrence Street is waterlogged. I'm tired of this water. I'm really tired of this water. The flooded roadway leaving some neighbors stranded. Dealing with all this water, trying to get back and forth, it is horrible. Couldn't even get the kids out to school this morning. This isn't a new problem. Every time it rains, this street flood. Not one time, every time it rains. But it doesn't make dealing with the mess any easier. Uh, back in the day, we used to have the older gentlemen that lived on the block that would try to clean the grates, mm -hmm. you know, but it's never been like this bad. Since Thursday, according to city officials, more than 275 flooded street drains have been cleared and countless departments have been pitching in, including 18 crews from the Department of Public Works, 53 crews from Detroit's Water and Sewage Department, and even Detroit firefighters were called in to make nine rescues. I've made several attempts to call the uh, Department of Water and Sewage. But on Lawrence Street, there have been no crews, no rescue, just a neighbor Cars with a rake. Can see. And so right now you can see they're uh, going down the roadway. You'll get a chance to see just about how deep it is out there in the middle. Now, obviously what's going on out here is there's some type of issue with the catch basins not being cleared. I did report it myself to the Department of Water and Sewage, and here's the best way for you to do it. Get your smartphone. It's a free app. It's called Improve Detroit. It's a free download, and you go ahead and you submit your issue through here, and what that does is is it creates a work order and then you can follow it and you can also check to make sure they got your complaint. For now, we're, we're live on the city's west side. Back to you. Well, hopefully a lot of people are listening to you and that will be